Hi there. You're in the lab with your mate JJ. So, uh, to follow my uh, five hour old book teardown video, I thought I might just have a quick video today. This is uh, just a little uh, a chore that I needed to uh, get done. I've been meaning to do this for a while now. Um, this is an unboxing of a network cable tester which I ordered recently um, at uh, AliExpress. Um, <clears throat> it's been sitting up here on my shelf for a while. Um, and I've been meaning to open it, so this is it here. Um, before I, uh, I pop you over the bench to, to take this guy out of the box, uh, I thought I might just uh, jump onto the computer and just show you uh, the equipment. Um, and then once we've done that, we can pop over, the, over to the bench and uh, have a look at this thing. <coughs> so uh, here we are on the, uh, on the bench, um, on the computer. Uh, this computer is... Uh, uh, proviso. It's my uh, um, in the lab with JJ uh, virtual machine. So uh, today I just wanted to uh, take you over to the to the new website. I actually should uh, should demo this soon. It's it's been coming along. Um, I want to just go over to the equipment. <coughs> it takes a while to load. Um, and then uh, network cable tester. There we go. So this Anning M469D network cable tester. I'm just going to click there, and that'll bring it up. And now here is the link to AliExpress. So I'm just going to click that, um, and it's going to open it up over on AliExpress. Now I paid. Uh, 525 total of 784 Aussie bucks, seven dollars and 84 cents Aussie. It's around about five bucks American. Uh, not very much money. Uh, so it says the high quality, um, high quality M469D RJ45 cable LAN tester, network cable tester. RJ45, RJ11, RJ12, CAT5, UTP, LAN, cable tester, networking repair tool. And it's got the remote side here, and then it's got the master side here, and it's by Anning, and I've got some other equipment by them. Um, and then uh, <coughs> come back to buy after, contact us if urgent need. High quality, blah blah blah. The yellow products in the video are for video reference only and will not be sold. Please refer to the received products. Alright. So, um, this is what we're going to be looking at. We're just going to pop it out of the box um, and and have a look. Maybe we'll, we'll test a, a cable together. We'll see. So, um, anyway, uh, this, is the, this is the product um, from AliExpress. Pretty cheap. Uh, and hopefully, uh, hopefully fairly good. I might as well point out that uh, in the cable tester department uh, today, uh, which is the uh, the 11th of July, that's actually yesterday now. Um, I got this other one. This is a multifunction tester. So this is the one we'll be unboxing today. Um, but this is the other one that I bought today. Um, and it's a HDMI tester as well. So I paid $6.93 for this one, which is less. And it's got an extra capability, which is the HDMI tester. So um, th this one um, that I ordered today can actually do HDMI and Ethernet. So, um, yeah, look. <laughs> um, <laughs> there's they, They're going to give us a deal here. A welcome deal, one dollar fifty. There you go. So usually sells for eighteen eighty one. It reckons uh, free shipping if you spend more than fifteen bucks. Anyway, I got this choice one today as well. So they were having a sale, and I got a whole heap of stuff. Anyway, that's not what we're doing today. Today we're looking at the uh, um, Anang M 
469D network cable tester. So uh, that's enough of this. Let's hop over to the bench and have a look at this thing. Here we are on the bench. So uh, I think our Ampcom might be the retailer, the reliable choice. National High Tech Enterprise ISO 9001, 2015 QMS certified company. So uh, they're from Shenzhen, China. And uh, this is the box. Can you see that? Uh, network and telephone cable tester, Ampcom. Uh, Auto version black, red, manual version black, red. Uh, the reliable choice, Ampcom. Engineering home cable system. On the back, it's, uh, it's difficult to read. It says uh, auto version instruction and manual version instruction. Press one second fast, slow switch, long press three seconds on, long press five seconds off lighting function, master remote, separated design, telephone cable, LAN cable, type C, external power, unvolt batteries, press twice to detect the connection, manual version, manually turn on or turn off, press one second fast slow switch, lighting function, master remote, separated design, telephone cable and LAN cable. So I don't know if we've got the manual version or the auto version or if the product does both, I don't know. Maybe we'll figure that out. Instructions for use. Open the back cover and connect the 9 volt battery according to the corresponding interface. Long press 3 seconds to turn the auto version tester on. Push the switcher, turn the manual version tester on. Connect the ca testing cable to the corresponding interface. UDP cable, master remote, light in, turn from 1 to 8. This doesn't mean much to me. Let's uh, let's have a look what's in the box. So this is a uh, a, a USB uh, Type A to USB C uh, power cable. Fair enough. And then there's uh, um, this is all that's left in the box. It's in a in a, a, a pleather. Um, pouch and here it is in all its glory. I don't think I've got much need for this pouch. And then there's just the oh, yeah, it's sealed, so we'll cut that open. And we've got, oh, isn't that funny? So um, I guess that's what that note was, that uh, this is not actually an Anning cable tester at all. So it's not what it says on the tin. Um, it's uh, Ampcom, designed by Ampcom. I don't know if I'm going to update my uh, documentation. How do I separate this? Yeah, that way, yeah, okay, cool. So, uh, not sure what that switch does. Maybe that's power. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. And, uh, and there's uh, a battery compartment in the back here. There we go. There she come. Just one 9 volt battery. We can do that. Here is the batteries, and might as well use this one, huh? I'll just uh, I'll just quickly test it. Uh, nine volt, uh, positive, and there we go. All right, it says that it's good. That's good.
not sure. Uh, looks like that will do. Not going in. Uh, I'm not sure. There we go. All right, now repairing on. Oh, there's a. Uh, oh, I see. This is just a light on and off. That's a nice touch, isn't it? It's got a little, got a little light. Cool. Um, now this is looks like RJ12, RJ11. And this is RJ45. So, man, I got so many cables. Here's one. It's a bit longer than it needs to be, but. That shouldn't be a problem. Now, okay, so three seconds on, five seconds off, one second auto switch. I don't know what one second auto switch means. Anyway, let's plug this guy together. So we're going to take this end and we'll make him remote. There we go. And we'll take this end and put him on the master. Now, what are we going to try? One second auto. That didn't seem to do anything. Okay, three seconds on. One, two, three. Okay, that didn't do anything. Hmm. Oh, there we go. All right. Okay, cool. So this is a straight through cable and uh, and it, uh, it's all working. So I'm going to press it for five seconds to turn it off. One, two, three, four, five. All right. So this is a, a patch cable. Let's see if we can find a crossover cable and let's see if it's different. I'll just uh, I'll just stop it while I find the cable. Just give me a second. All right, I'm back and I found this cable. It says uh, uh, Cat Six RJ45 uh, UTP Ethernet crossover cable red. So apparently this is a crossover cable. <coughs> and uh, there's probably no need to uh, uh, take it apart. We'll just put this guy uh, here. I'm going to take it apart, why not? <coughs> Pardon me. So, uh, I, uh, I want to keep the, I'm going to keep them the bits together like that and I'll put him in there and him in there. And then we'll press in one, two, three. There he goes. And you can see the crossover cable. So that's very cool, isn't it? So one goes to three, two goes to six, three goes to one, four goes to four, five goes to five, six goes to two, seven goes to seven, and eight goes to eight. And we hold that long press off, and off it goes. What an excellent bit of kit. I'm very happy. 
I didn't get the Anang one, and I'm going to have to mess around updating my uh, documentation. Um, but this is the Ampcom, uh, and it doesn't seem to have a model number. Uh, Land slash Tel Tester. Uh, yeah, I don't know what all those numbers and bits and pieces there mean. Anyway, so. So, that uh, concludes the unboxing. Um, it is not uh, an Anang bit of kit that I was showing you on the website. Uh, it's an Ampcom land tester. Um, it comes with a little light. Uh, it uh, works with uh, um, patch cables and crossover cables. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with it for a couple of bucks. So. Uh, yeah, that, that concludes this unboxing video. Uh, there's going to be a few more videos coming out this week. I've got all sorts of things to catch up with, so uh, yeah, stick around. Um, and uh, thanks very much for watching. And uh, please remember to hit like and subscribe.